Hey guys, uh, today we're checking out a challenge which I actually forgot the name of. <laughs> Wait. So Eclipse has a bunch of challenges that come with the mod. This one is called Beatmaster. We're playing as the Lost, but we can't really shoot. And you're probably wondering, Gorinch, what is that? What, what, what is that? Go, tell me, Gorinch, what is that? I, I, calm down. That's my, that's my active item. The only time I can use it is when it flashes like that. And when I do use it, we just use Tammy's head. Every consecutive time I manage to hit the perfect beat, we get more stats and we also shoot tears. So that's the only way for me to actually deal damage. Uh, awful item to start with because it's unusable. Uh, but yeah, this one is going to be quite interesting. <laughs> We're basically playing Crypt of the Isaac Dancer or something. I don't know. It, it, it's cool. It's a, Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> and also, I think the more you hit the beats, the faster they get. So it becomes more difficult to hit them. Uh, Lodestone? Oh, I can't focus. We actually start losing beats. We only lose two at a time. So it's not that big of a deal. Uh, Lodestone. I think I'm gonna reroll that. I think it's worth rerolling. What happens if I press it early? Can I just spam it? Oh, I can just... I mean... Ah, okay, there's no penalty to pressing it early. So that seems kind of unfair. Because <laughs> I can just keep spamming space. But I'm not going to do that. I'm going to actually try to time it. I don't want to cheat it. I'm not going to cheat the system. Where's the fun in that, you know? He's taking damage. <laughs> We're actually dealing a ton of damage. Uh, Magic 8 ball. Yeah, pick that up. Uh, let's... Ooh, what is that? Two of diamonds. Okay. Uh, open this. I think we can open it. Nice. Okay. And let's see all this. Ooh. Okay. I think we have a synergy going on. Oh, yeah. What is that? Bacon bacon pancakes. That's a very obscure reference that no one will get. Uh, health up, tears up, damage up, uh, pretty much everything up. So I'm gonna pick it up. Oh, it actually gives you items. We get a bomb, which means I can blow this up. Get a Soha. That's very useful for me. I uh, get the safety scissors. I think that might save me sometimes. But yeah, I wish they made it so I actually have to time it. And it doesn't work if I spam it. Maybe if the devs are watching, they can fix it. But yeah, you can you can just spam it. The finger? Oh, well, I, I guess now we have a way to deal damage without actually using the thing. Okay, use High Priestess. Easy clap. Uh, Topicana, yep. Uh, a tame... Uh, tame is perfect. Yeah, with a tame, I think we got this. Thankfully, we're playing as the Lost and not Tainted Lost. That makes things significantly easier. If we can get homing tiers as well, that, that would be... That would be swell. Okay, go in here. Oh, it's it's this guy. This is one of my least favorite guys. Perfection? I don't think we need perfection. Range up, range up is good. Range up is very good. You don't need to be perfect, guys. You just need to be you. Uh, we get a planetarium at a 16% chance. Oh, this is new. Eclipse, while shooting guns, boosting aura. Plus 2 point damage boost when Curse of Darkness is active. Okay. Oh, it's while I'm shooting. So I need to be using the finger. So I guess we have a posing aura now. Which means we don't really need uh, the Beatmaster, but this is actually really good. Uh, Conehead. Nice, we get the finger and we get Conehead. We have the full synergy. Well, there goes the challenge. <laughs> There, there goes the whole challenge. I can just I can just go into rooms and post enemies. We have Tainted Unbidden's main mechanic. Oh yeah, this guy can't really bomb me. Because I turn bombs into my bombs. I mean, this is still a lost turn. So we might die at any moment. I still need to play well. Okay, bot fly. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. A defensive item. Yeah, that's pretty good to have. Okay, let's build up the let's build up the thing. So I think 12 is the max you can go. Okay, there we go. Now go in and decimate. There we go. Wooden spoon, nice speed up. Uh, do we fight mom straight away? We don't really have anything else to go to. So let's do that. I keep mistiming it. Oh, that's bad for us. <laughs> that's that's not good for us. That's not good for us. But we did it. Okay. Uh, we actually managed to go in here. And we get Gnawed Leaf. But I can't really deal damage, so I would just end up dead. Uh, let's go. I guess this is gonna be a pretty quick video, but... If I do die against Mom's Hut, uh, I'm, I'm done. Okay, build up the thing. Nice. <laughs> Even if we didn't use the Beating Hut, uh, I think it would've still been fine. 
Uh, Hall of Babylon, that's just straight up damage, right? Yeah. Man, it's getting too fast. I can't... <laughs> I can't keep up with it. It's getting too fast. I need to constantly look at my head. Or maybe the thing with this is that I just need to remember the beat. Just get the beat down. No need to spam. Just, just get the beat down. Okay, open this. Uh, Holy Crown, that's unusable because the challenge ends. Once we reach Mom's Hut, the challenge pretty much ends. Unless we get something extra, but I don't think we can. I don't think we can go to Satan or something. So, oh, I, oh, that could have been bad. <laughs> if we didn't have Eclipse, that could have been bad. Okay, we found Mom's Hut. Let's build it up. I want to just go in there and one shot. I don't want to give her a single chance. There we go. There we go. <laughs> well, that's how you do it. I don't know how long the final video will be, but if you enjoyed this, feel free to uh, leave a like. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.